All right, thank you, David. It's 6 30 here on your Monday. The Shawnee County Sheriff's Office wants to start using drones to stop burglaries and thefts in the county today. KSNT News reporter James Ryan is live in Tecumseh right now with details on what this program could look like. That's right, Brittany. I am live outside of Shawnee Heights High School this morning, and there's going to be a public meeting here tonight with the Shawnee County Sheriff's Office where they're going to address the new initiative they hope will address crime as it happens. Now, the Shawnee County Sheriff's Office wants to start flying drones over public roadways and pathways during times when they think crime will be high. Sheriff Bryant Hill says it's important for the public to know what these drones can and cannot do. Those systems can't look through the walls of your house. We're not recording things. Um, we're not listening to, they don't have the listening capabilities. It's simply a visual tool to see what's in that open area. Sheriff Hill says these drones would be used basically the same way that a helicopter is used by law enforcement. He says they'll be using crime data to determine where and when the drones should be used. And he says this is all to address a growing, pro, pro, uh, growing problem. Over the past two years, they have seen crime that is thefts uh, from cars, car thefts, and burglaries go up 21% out in the county, and so they are going to be using or hope to be using these drones in those specific neighborhoods to kind of calm that down. Live in Tecumseh, James Ryan, KSNT News. All right, thank you for bringing us the details this morning, James. Again, this public meeting on the drones is tonight at 6 o'clock in the Shawnee Heights uh, High School Auditorium there, but there will be another one. Uh, another meeting for this is at the Washburn Rural Middle School Library, and that's tomorrow night at the same time.